Just so our Japanese fans can tell that the show is live, this is the time in Japanese, right? Are you ready? Yes. Yeah. There you are. <laughs> and that included an apology to all British soldiers as well, isn't that? <laughs> <laughs> so, Sylvia, you're a Holland fan. Uh, I'm a, basically a fan of beautiful football. Yeah. Uh, I'm sorry. And I must say you that, uh, that uh, well, I liked uh, oh, the Nigerians. You love to watch I Arsenal like play. Okay, I love Arsenal. Let's all right. speak. You're killing okay. our careers here, Johnny. I've built yours you know, up. I've you, done, done a few, a few, <laughs> <laughs> done a few erotic movies in your time. For so what? It must have been fun to watch a few Dutch cats. No, but I was once engaged to an Englishman called McShane and his father, Harry McShane, used to play for Manchester, uh, Manchester United, and don't make me nervous. Dave, that was Ian McShane, wasn't it? Dave, tell us about yeah. Rude Hullet. Right. He was Dutch. He was Dutch. The thing about Rude Hullet, right, it's all right for him to yeah, comment on Dutch. players in this World Cup, but when he was a World Cup player, yeah. he looked up a dog's ass. <laughs> 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 I think it's something anyway, to do with his hairdo. There's a, uh, I don't know if you've read, you know the England players are banned from having sex until the end of the World Cup? Yeah. yeah no, that was my well, I, th I think it's very good that they don't have sex with each other before. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think they strictly are banned they, from They can do whatever they like after, but they've got to win something first. <laughs> they are banned, they are. No. It's medals, isn't it? You know. David Beckham's actually got a wrist injury at the moment, which worries me. <laughs> <laughs> Go shake Sheringham when you won the Cup. Yes. Yes. Well, interestingly enough, a bloke called... Where are you reading this off? <laughs> anyway, it just, so happens, it just so happens that we have an expert on football and sex. Yes. We've got him on a live satellite link. It's Dr Jack Weinberg from the Institute of Sexology, who believes that sex is actually very good for footballers. After sex, the brain releases chemicals which make men feel good, so it actually improves their football. Let's so go, can we go to Jack, Jack Weinberg now. You're there. there he is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Do you actually? So, hello, hello, Jack. Yeah. Good evening, uh, gentlemen. Good evening, Frank. Good evening, David. Hello. Uh, uh, tell us, do you actually think that sex is very good just before a football match? Well, I'm not so sure just before, but I don't think there's any problem with having it the, on the day. I wouldn't think there's any problem with that at all. Depends what time the kickoff is, of course. You're Amer yeah. You're American, aren't you, Jack? Yeah, that's right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> from Bristol, Connecticut. Right. Okay. <laughs> and when did you stop off in Australia? Yeah. When did that <laughs> so, have you got a question? And um, dare I ask this? If I guess, got a question for Dr. Weinberg. T no. <laughs> <laughs> Who's so, Dr. Um, Weinberg? Dr. Weinberg. Yeah. Oh, him, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, Sylvia, have you got a question for Dr. Weinberg about sex and football? Um. No. Okay. <laughs> it's going well, this bit. <laughs> okay, thank yeah, you. Yeah, I do. Much. How do you have sex with a football? Right. There you go. How do you have sex <laughs> with a football? I think with difficulty. <laughs> oh, I bet he's an expert at it, though. Look at the state of him. Anyway. <laughs> thank you very much. Uh, anyway, what shall we yeah. talk about now? Have you seen this? This is a, a footage. Have you seen this? He's the mascot. Of oh, the, the French thing. Yeah, and look, this yeah. one laughs. <laughs> This is a bit like you at the start of Anarchy in the UK, I think. It's a bit like that. Careful now, you might get smacked. <laughs> Come on, then. You don't mind like a cigarette, do you? I don't yeah, know. a cigarette like by all minds. No, no, We're dealing with no, healthy footballers here. No, 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 I'm cut no, my footage. I'm going to get to the commercial break and see if we can get rid of John. Um, <laughs> Oh, great moments yeah. from the Lies of England managers. Number three, Alf Ramsey says something a bit mental. 